we just had to keep playing. We just had to keep fighting. Uh, this year has been a little rocky uh, thus far, but uh, yeah, we're, we're looking to we're looking to uh, turn it around. We still have a lot of ball games left, and we can still uh, be contenders at the when it's all said and done. I think it just come down. Uh, I can't speak for the other guys. Uh, I'm just tired of losing. So, uh, like you said, I was uh, really aggressive tonight, and uh, yeah, that means I, I'm just tired of losing. So, if I gotta shoot every time and for us to get a win, then that's what I'm gonna do. If I if I don't have to shoot any at the ball at all, then that's what I'm gonna do. I'm just I'm just trying to win. I'm just I'm just so tired of losing. So yeah, I feel like um, we've been there a lot of times where we come back before, lost the game by four. So every time in the huddle, we just remind remind each other. Um, how we don't want, want that same feeling in the locker room. So we pretty much had that baggage behind us and want to keep pushing and keep going forward. Yeah, I mean, I couldn't be more proud of them. Uh, you know, we've, uh, it's not an easy thing to do, you know, when we've been losing, uh, like we've been losing and, and uh, in the manner in which we've lost, uh, you know, we've, they're battling. I mean, the kids are really battling hard and, and um, uh, you know, it takes so much energy to come back the next day. Uh, for practice and prepare uh, when you haven't been getting the result, uh, the win. And they did it, you know, they did it. They've been battling uh, all week long. They've, they've, uh, I was really concerned about our practice after the Ball State game because of the way we lost over there and, and uh, in a close game. And uh, the, I walked back in and on Sunday and they're ready to go. And so, um, and then to come down from 21 tonight, uh, you know, they started off again. Ohio started off like they did at their place. They started off blazing hot. Um, some of it was, uh, again, self-inflicted. It happened at times. But a lot of it, again, they're knocking down shots. You know, and they're a good offensive basketball team. But, but later on, they, and then the comeback, and I thought Thomas's shot there at the, at the end of the half was great for us. Uh, I mean, to get it to a two-possession game and to come back and cut that down, um, it served us well mentally in the second half because we had proved to ourselves we could do it. So even when they took the lead back up in the second half, uh, we knew in the back of our minds we've done this already in the first half. And, and this time uh, we didn't run out of time. Uh, there's been a couple other games this year where we had been playing well at the end and felt like if the game had gone another three, four, five minutes, uh, you know, we, uh, we might have had a shot at winning. It didn't. Um, this time we closed it out and, and, uh, in 40 minutes make sure I bring up because I don't want our fans thinking that I'm a, a nut case here is um, we were supposed to foul the last play of the game. Okay. Uh, the <laughs> we were we talked about it. We tried to foul. We committed the foul. They didn't call the foul. Right. And that's why Carter had that last look. Uh, <coughs> we, had, we were up three. Uh, yeah. We were up three. We actually talked about it. The bring the ball once shot clock gets down inside of 10 uh, to, uh, anywhere anything if we can let it get down inside eight great but if they're really penetrating you know <laughs> then we're looking to foul and uh, they had somebody wide open there but that wasn't by design